I don't know how long this video is going to be because it turns out this is just a teaser trailer, but as you can tell by the title and thumbnail, we're going to be reacting to the new Resident Evil CGI film. I guess it just got announced called Death Island. I didn't even know there was plans for another one. Now, I will say, even though I am very much excited for this, both Vendetta and Infinite Darkness were kind of, they're kind of the same, if I'm being honest. Like, don't get me wrong, they're great, but the storyline is just always, and you could argue, obviously, with Resident Evil that that's all the, you know, where that's not my point. My point is that they're too similar, if that makes sense. Now, this could be the one that changes all that. This could be the one that gets me in trouble because I'll say that the Netflix series is also better than this because it's definitely better than Welcome to Raccoon City, which I'm not even going to debate you on that one. But I've been talking too much. So let's uh, go ahead and go into the trailer because it's only 30 seconds long. Hold on. Let me make sure the quality is not potato. This looks like, um, oh my God. Well, we got Leon. Alcatraz, were we in Warzone? Got Chris on a boat on an island of despair. What is that? Liquors can swim? Okay. Oh, let me just play it out. What game is that? Who is that? Is that Ashley? <laughs> we'll play it out. Hold on. Let me pause. Or is that the one girl from Vendetta? Dead Rising. That's the game in the mall with the zombies. That's either Ashley or the girl from uh, Vendetta. I don't remember if she died or not. Uh, Leon's on a motorcycle again. Is that a giant liquor? If that's a giant liquor, that's stupid as hell. Resident Evil Death Island. Death Island. Okay. What's up, Jeff? Hold the fucking phone. Wait a minute. Jeff, if this is one, a <laughs> two, if this is like their way of including Jill again after not for like a hundred years, it's going to be pretty bullshit. Oh shit. We technically, we got half the cast right there. Not you, baby Nemi. hundred dollars and you're smaller than Jill. That's kind of, <laughs> ultimately what I'm getting at is I doubt we'll see Claire in here because we already have three of them. And even though Claire was in what, Damnation or Degeneration, whatever the airport one was. Yeah. I prefer Claire over Jill any day of the week. But failure, why do you have a Jill statue and not a Claire statue? Because they didn't sell a Claire statue. They sold Leon for the Resident Evil 2 remake, even though they knew they were going to make the Resident Evil 4 remake and make Leon that stupid. But I digress. Again, I'm excited for this. Expectations are, of course, low, as they are with any Resident Evil movie. But I'm here for it. When did they say it comes out? Summer. Fun fact, my, uh... <laughs> My first ever video on my channel. Let me see if I can find it. Oh, maybe not my very first. But one of my very first videos was a Vendetta review. Ain't that something? Pretty depressing, to be honest. But yeah, I guess there's no need to milk this any more than I already have. Like I said, we're obviously interested. We're obviously going to watch it, but our expectations are low. Will it beat Netflix? According to me, probably not. According to everybody else. <laughs> Welcome to Raccoon City apparently beats net the Netflix series, so I don't complete disrespect of a movie, but y'all can't handle, I don't know. On a side note though, and even though these are Resident Evil 3 specifically, uh, yeah, if you wanna get some G Fuel, use code FAIL. Did that even pick that up? If you wanna get some G Fuel, G, <laughs> oh my God. Use code FAIL for at least 20% off your G Fuel. They'll probably do something with Resident Evil 4, I'm hoping so. Although after what I said about the Netflix series, you probably won't, but either way, I digress. At the end of the day, Resident Evil has always been and will always be my favorite franchise. So if you can get your panties out of the bunch, out of a bunch, I can't even talk tonight. I'm Failure7X, thank you for watching. Now get off me.